So today I would like to speak with you about the SIAM pro this article. So SIAM provides uh, access to nearly all scholarly literature that basically is based on the monopoly um, of scholarly literature. Because act actually uh, now, just uh, like after decades of efforts, just one or two um, uh, new, newly published articles are available without paywalls. So the open access, uh, uh, as you can see, uh, the open access article are like uh, increasing all the little bit uh, years by years, but not a lot. And there are different criticisms that are proposed in the journal, in the paper. Uh, one, the first one is uh, like one of the most important is the prohibitive expensive price of a journal subscription. So actually all the, um, the subscription per year uh, cost a lot. So you can see here in dollar okay, but also in euro uh, that each journal it's super expensive. So first uh, the, monopoly, the, the monopoly of academic literature for sure is uh, uh, due also to, this, uh, to, to the price. Um, so, the, co consequently, um, if the price of journal is very high like that, um, small institutions and developing world are not very, uh, cannot actually pay uh, this price. And moreover, some estimation uh, from EBSCO uh, say that actually the, the price of the subscription the subscription per year is increasing, um, so it's not something that it's going better and better. So here you can see the ever price per title. I don't know if you are familiar with that. I never asked me myself how much it could be cost uh, per year as a journal subscription because I actually we have the chance uh, to be uh, to be paid. I mean, our sub journal subscription is paid from Interm or for University of Bodo, but actually you can see here is very expensive. So um, the second criticism is the copyright. Uh, as well, I, I don't know, I, I guess that you are familiar with that, uh, but legally, uh, so the copyright is the, uh, I mean, the protection about the original works that can be like figures or images or some other stuff and that other people cannot modify. So uh, the, from, from one, one end, of course, the copyright is something very important and very, um, I mean, very uh, useful because it, it allows you to protect your data. But on the other hand, of course, it, keep, it helps to keep the monopoly of scholar literature because you cannot use um, the image of somebody else, you cannot publish it, you cannot like use other table and everything. So uh, there is a, it's a real criticism because it, there are two, I mean, it's not uh, very easy. Um, another criticism is also the journal access uh, in general, because actually in the article they divided the journal access to tall or closed access, that means the, the journal that are um, protected by paywalls, that say, so that are available with paywalls, the liberal the liber access uh, uh, journal uh, that are without openly licensed, free for use, and the gratis access. So the gratis access are the, all the journal without paywall, free of charge. Uh, so as you can know, uh, SAYAB is a, it can be considered a solution uh, for um, the monopoly of uh, scholarly literature because actually um, Alexandra Albaikan, a Kazakhstan neuroscientist of um, two years old, 10 years, uh, almost 10 years uh, um, ago, created this, uh, um, this site, this uh, website um, that allow you to um, download journal without paywall. Um, this journal, gratis journal, so they are uh, with some copyrights, but you can download for free. So of course, uh, SIAB is very useful because uh, actually use a, a, a credential from educational institutions and allow you to have uh, the journal that you want. 
but uh, you have to say you have to know that readers um, can be uh, I mean can have a consequence for that because they can uh, they can be legally uh, considered so um sayab unfortunately he has to he was condemned um a lot of times so once in uh, in the 15 by from lcb and, and another time in the 17 from the american chemistry society and so he has to he was condemned he was he has to pay a lot of uh, millions uh, because of the copyright problem another piece uh but uh, interest, interestingly, um, Sayab uh, downloads are more prefer preferentially from poor countries with poor institutional access. So you can see here in this map that um, in red, like light red, like Bordeaux points, there are all the uh, all the countries that use uh, Sayab. Most of them, like South America, like uh, yeah, Sri Lanka, and everything are very like chemicals very poor. So uh, it is important that Sayab allows all uh, everybody to to download to have access to gratis. Uh, gra I mean, without paywall to uh, journals. And moreover, we have to underline also the fact that uh, the twenty five percent of downloads are from chemical medicine. So that is also very important. Um, here we can see the interest uh, of supporters. So here there is the number of donation per per month uh, from the um, 2015 to uh, 17, and you can see that in average it's quite a lot. So also this uh, supporter allow the the Sayab uh, um, website and Alexandra to pay the condemned that uh, she received that. Um, our last uh, very important point is that, uh, as you can see in this uh, plot, uh, more uh, citation are derived by more Sayab dialogue. That's, that uh, means that actually more, uh, there is an increasing, there is a positive uh, plot between the number of Sayab, Sayab dolans and the number of citation. That is very important. It means that actually more uh, i mean the, the article is available for free more is uh, is also uh, convenient for from for the editors uh, so um, after all those uh, criticisms that uh, are presented in the article uh, i try i would like to 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 to, to, to speak with you about the, maybe the best solution because actually in all these kind of access, like the toll access, the open access, and the gratis access journal, there are some problems and some positive stuff. Because of course, in the toll access, that uh, we say that, that the closed access with paywall, paywalls and copyright, uh, the positive we can say that is that. Of course, the the copyright is protected, and there is no uh, problems of uh, protection of the data and everything. But in the open access, uh, so in, in the journal, um, in the journal that are available without paywalls, of course, also they are very cool stuff because you can download and you can use every journal that you want. You can use the image. You can really collaborate with the editors, and you can, uh, I mean, deeply share all the in the scientific in the scientific community your works. So I think that that's very cool. But also, uh, cool stuff are also in the gratis access because, of course, it's super nice that you can keep your copyright, your the right of your ideas, the right of your um, images and everything, but you can, at, at the same time, uh, have a journal without paywall for free. So um, I would like to speak with you about a, a possible solution between those, um, I mean, those kind of uh, journals, uh, because maybe we can think about different price of the institution or different price of, or for the career for the I mean, depending according on your position. Like if you are a PhD student, maybe you can have less. Uh, you can you uh, can pay less than a postdoc and everything. But the funny stuff is that actually when I uh, thought about these possible solutions, 
uh, I saw later that the journal uh, proposed also the same. So, for example, yeah, I put the, um, the uh, price per year of the journal in neuroscience that uh, divided the price for categories. So, in the first categories, you have all the community, technical, uh, technician, and everything. In the second, you have non PhD uh, granting students. In the third, you have mainly the doctorate student and everything. But the fact, the funny fact is that still the the price is very high, so it is, it was not a solution for the journal actually. So we are, I mean, we can open a, a discussion about what do you think about the toll access and open access and the gratis assets, assets, and of course about copyright and the criticism about SIAB that uh, are. Uh, I mean, point out in this article, this work. And yeah. 